Hello everyone, uh, this is the last turtle. I've decided to actually launch my Let's Play career and I'll be starting with Black Mesa. A mod for the Source Engine, seeking to recreate the first Half-Life game. Uh, I haven't played the first Half-Life game actually, I don't think I will. But I have played uh, the second all part of the second game. I've also played Portal and Portal 2, so I'm definitely not new to the whole universe. I've played a bit of this already, uh, mainly because first I started playing without wanting to LP it, and then decided to LP it later, and second of all because this is my second attempt to actually record this. The first attempt failed miserably because I managed to fuck up my controls which ended up in just cutting off half half the recording because I pressed press the button that quick loads and uh, stops wraps at the same time. Yes, I. So, so, as I said, since I've already played some of this, I won't actually be surprised by most of it. I will try to provide a witty commentary now to make up for my lack of surprise and shock horror. If I didn't move too much, it's like a cinematic. Except that you can see the stains on the glass.
Black Mesa guys really did a good job on this. Uh, I watched uh, Freeman's Mind. If if you'll know that, it's sort of a let's play with a plot. And I mean, it, it, Half Life One looks like a pretty good game. It's definitely not bad. It's just new. Not modern. A reminder that the Black Mesa Hazard Course Decathlon will commence this evening at 1900 hours in the Level 3 facility. The semifinals for high security personnel will be announced in a separate secure broadcast transmission. Half Life 1 was definitely a good game in that it. Wasn't it like one of the very first modern shooters? Well, I'm not dissing Half Life 1, it was a good game. I'm just saying that Black Mesa. Black. The. I mean, uh, the team of Black Mesa did a good job of uh, making everything look very modern. Do you have a friend or very. Who would make a valuable nice. To the Black Mesa team? Immediate openings are available in the areas of. Materials handling. And. Low clearance security. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. If you have an associate with a background in the areas of As a robot. physics, biotechnology, or other high-tech disciplines, the convenience robot is just appearing out of nowhere. The Black Mesa facility is an equal opportunity employer. The place I'm going to is really deep. Regular radiation and that's pretty obvious. Are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a schedule of your analysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. Oh, he has the robot that we should be smashing into. Or other hazardous materials. Seriously. Look at him. He should have just smashed us off the rail, I guess. Oh, and the thing I pointed out in my last attempted at recording. The other guy there is just chilling. It's no big deal to him that everything around him is just exploding. And here he comes. Black here. Nothing but black. Hello. Morning, Mr. Freeman. Hello. Looks like you're running late. No. Maybe. What's it to you? I'm running late for the Boy, third time. Pretty scarce around these parts. Time to walk. Guess his bar tab must have finally caught up with. He owes me a beer. Barney owes me a beer. Stop. Oh man, you cut the ponytail. Yes. Sell out. My wife made me. I didn't want to. I'm cool. It's it's my wife. She made me. Hello. Hey, Mr. Freeman. I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about, I don't know, 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were also having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Now, I'm going to po point out that everything around here is very modern. It looks pretty cool. And you can notice that this is supposed to be like the late 90s, 
The fact that you're using these monitors. Okay. You can pull a switch there to set the alarm off, but I'm not going to do that now. I'm sort of tired. Tired of doing this section again and again. Hello. Okay, so you can go there. I'm just going to skip everything. You can go all around here, it's pretty cool. Oh, this I'm going to do. Hello. Run! Yes. Just take refuge Why here. Do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Ties are awesome, shut up. Oh, lag. Oh, you can give this guy toilet paper. No toilet paper. Technically, you can give him paper towels, which is kind of like toilet paper. But I already got the achievement for that. And you know what they say. Hello? You should not be nice get me some toilet paper? unless you're getting achievements for it. So don't feel bad in just placing oh, a bunch thank of. Thank heavens! I'm in dire need of some Fuck toilet you. paper. Give, give it. Don't be nice, kids. Be assholes. <sighs> okay, let's go blow up shit. Ha! Ah, normal. That's... Hmm. That's not one word for it. It's not anyone for it. Good day. Thank you. But let me through. Thank you. Greetings. There are these cool screens. Let's read them. Technology. Innovation. If you want to read these, just pause, I guess. I've already read these. So. I'm 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 looking at them for you. Hmm. I've oft been told my left side is better. Ah. Yep, we're done here. Let's go to the other side. I'm curious who actually looks at these. Do they give... Do they give people tours of their rockets? And their underground chambers of... Toxic materials everywhere? Because that does not seem like it would be very good. Safety! Lots of rockets. Our tram system is really cool! I guess. Okay, I think that's it. Yep, let's go. The first time I played this, I killed myself by tr Wait. Maybe not? I killed myself somewhere trying to go down the ladder. <laughs> Instead of the elevator. Oh, maybe I just jumped out of here? I don't know. I did something stupid, that's the gist of it. I knew a lot of stupid things. To whom it may concern, those loading screens are actually really awfully long. 
I'm just too nice to let you guys see them. Hello, sir. Let's check the Brewster's plates angles and make sure these superluminescent diodes are protected from optical. Yes. Mm -hmm. We well, should check the electromagnetic wave the diapason. Are on the fritz again. Oh no! I assure you, we've compensated for any contingency. You guys know. What's up, Doc? Ready for another rousing day, Freeman? No. I am not ready for any of this. Hello. Doctor Freeman. Wow, good reaction. Ah, good. Hello. There you are. Nice of you to finally join us, Doctor. We've just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105 percent. Bit of a gamble, but we needed the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather he went to some lengths to get it. Mm. They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. Right. Come on, then. I'll walk you down. Screw you. Eli has been busy making last-minute preparations for the new experiment. Oh. Who's Eli? Greetings, Eli. Morning, Izzy. I trust this morning. Oh, you. I forgot you. Good morning. Hello. I'm glad you're here. These last-minute changes, they're a bit strange to just... Oh, it's about to go critical. Oh, no. What in the blazes is going on with our equipment? Oh, it was never meant to do this in the first place. Oh. It's nothing we can't handle ourselves, Eli. Did, am I not wanted here? We'll be but a moment. Oh. Oh, I see how it is. Very well. Goodbye. G goodbye. You all like this trash. Beckrell's ghost. The radiation level is off the charts. Let's do this experiment anyways. This isn't going to end horribly at all. Oh, there you are. Hello. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. Oh, great. Oh, here he is. Hello. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedure today, Gordon. Yes, yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And oh. potentially the most unstable. No, oh. no, as long as we follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that. Although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. Extremely. Don't Gordon feel... doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. I am very good at pushing cards. That nothing will go wrong. Yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. I, I can see. Well, that. go ahead. Let's let him in now. Alright, and we'll see what's, what will await us inside next time. Thanks for watching, guys.